Oh, ni hao, Yan Yan Food Tube fans. Chef Michael here in Australia. I'm just peeling the husks off this beautiful corn cob because I'm going to char grill it shortly and put it into my very simple and delicious spinach and feta pie. Would you like to see what's in it? And let's see how we make it. So let's look at our ingredients. I've got 250 grams of frozen chopped spinach, about 200 grams of Greek style feta, half a cup of pine nuts, two teaspoons of uh, white pepper, one egg, one echelot, and one corn on the cob. The other thing you'll need for this recipe is 12 sheets of phyllo pastry. So the first thing I'll need to do, get as much moisture and water out of my frozen chopped spinach. And then you can just leave it to strain. Next up, go to char grill my corn cob. So I've lit one of my gas stove top and I'm just gonna put it on there. And then you just leave it till it's a little bit charred and then you just keep turning it. Now that's done, I'm gonna take that off and that'll give the uh, pie a nice smoky flavor. So with the feta cheese, the grated, and it can just go straight into the bowl. Now, with the corn, all I have to do is take it off the cob. By char grilling it, that'll just give it a lovely smoky flavour, and that goes straight into my big mixing bowl, ready to go. Just pounding up my pepper, and that can just go straight in as well. And now just to finish off, in with the spinach, in with my pine nuts, one egg, and then I can just mix all that thoroughly through. So now I'm ready to assemble my pie and I'll need one of these. This is a eight and a half inch, 22 centimeter Pyrex pie dish. So the other thing I'll need for this is about half a cup of olive oil and I'll use that to brush in between the sheets of my phyllo pastry. So, I take one sheet of my phyllo pastry and I can pop that in there and I just brush a little bit of oil, olive oil, on the bottom. Again, just brush, lightly brush the olive oil up around the sides as well and then I just fold that one in. I'm going to use about six sheets on the bottom and about six sheets on the top. One more, and that'll be six sheets on the bottom. Now, I just put my filling in. Make sure your filling is evenly spread. And then we start the process of the pastry sheets again. So now my pie is ready to go into the oven. All I need to do now is take a knife and trim around the edges and trim all the excess pastry off. And there you go, there's my spinach and feta pie ready for the oven. Now the other good thing about this recipe is that you can actually freeze it if you don't want to bake it straight away. So just cover it over in, uh, with some uh, cling wrap and pop it in the freezer. And then when you're ready to go, take it out, thaw it out, pop it into the oven. Into the oven, 180 degrees for about 25 minutes. So that's been about uh, 25 minutes, 20 minutes. Let's have a look. Beautiful, look at that, lovely and golden brown. So let's see how my pies turned out. So there we have my beautiful, very simple, delicious spinach feta, corn, uh, pine nut pie. Mmm. 
Yum yum delicious.